It's not, you know, it's it's better than being dead. <laughs> but you know, it's it's not ideal. But you know, Patrick Bear bearing through the pain of not being able to do what makes him happy. It makes a lot of people happy, and it's really the only job in my life I've ever had that makes me happy, and that makes other people happy too. So, I think it's a winning, winning formula. That formulates into Fluffy the Dragon. Bear's alter ego that's usually seen joyfully riding his motorcycle. Oh, no. Dressed up as a fluffy dragon, you know, singing and dancing. Well, I'm not going to be dancing, but I'm definitely going to be singing. Oh, no, 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 no. Bear's Instagram account has more than 200,000 followers, showcasing his adventures on the Seattle streets. But for the last three weeks, Bear has traded in his costume for crutches and a medical boot. It's just blood everywhere, but you know, at the end of the day, I'm just grateful I'm alive. Bear says on August 3rd, a speeding green Honda collided with him in the Mount Baker neighborhood. He now has several broken bones in his foot, fractured ribs, and a broken jaw. Threw on my front brakes as quickly as I could. The next thing I know, I was basically backwards about 10 feet from the intersection on the ground, coughing up blood. Police say witnesses saw three people, two males and a female, in the Honda running away from the scene. The owner of the car then reported it stolen. So whoever did this, hopefully it'll be like their wake-up call on their road to, you know, to better their life and learn from it. Bears learned to never take life for granted. He expects to be fully recovered and back riding early next year. Find their passion and, and pursue it because, you know, I mean, your life is short and you might as well do something you love. In Seattle, Brady Wakayama, King 5 News.